Hey guys, here we have a small setup video. Some of you have been requesting um, how to set a boat up correctly and I can only tell from what I do, but uh, one of the key things uh, is uh, of course the, the angle of attack in the water. So, so the angle of the drives is very important. And as you can see here, it might be a bit hard to see, but um, the angle is basically um, so from your planing surfaces and then the angle that you have compared to the planing surfaces is, uh, is, um, is either up or down compared to that. So a completely level strut angle would be uh, parallel to the planing surfaces of the boat. So, um, so if you see here, the planing surfaces of the boat uh, would, be, uh, would be in parallel to the struts. And I think here, right here, I have about a negative one degree or something. Uh, and I don't really see the benefit of going over uh, zero degrees, so I, I don't see any benefit of, of the struts pointing upwards, at least not on a catamaran like this. Uh, but the general idea is that the more you have your struts pointing downward, uh, the more the transom will lift. So the transom will lift out the water and then the nose will come down. So if you, want, if you have a boat that's very, very unstable and very flippy, Something you could do is is to is to lower the angle of attack. So so bring the the the, the drives um, uh, negative more. So if if, if let's say I was uh, uh, having a lot of flips and the boat was just uh, you know pointing the nose up all the time, I would I would definitely go in and 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 lower the the struts uh, to try to combat that. The idea is that the closer to zero you can get with the struts, uh, the more efficient the boat will run. Um, as long as um, as you don't flip, of course. But if you you can say if you go into a flip scenario, then you have a tiny bit too much um, lift in the front, basically. Um, yeah. Another thing in regards to setup is is the battery placement. So the general idea here is also that um, the further back you have your batteries, the more uh, the nose will come up and the further front you have it, the more the nose will come down. So that's also something you can, you can go in and play with. Um, let's see what's more. Um, yeah, that's, that's basically the tuning that I do. So, um, and the general idea is that you you want uh, you want to set the strut angle to something that's sensible, so minus one degree maybe, uh, closing in on that zero, like I, like we said before. And then what you want to do is that you want to start with a very upfront battery placement, and then you can then you can then you can gradually uh, um, pull your batteries to the to the. Um, to the far back so that you will start coming into a lift scenario. So in general you want to bring your batteries back if you want to create some more lift on the front. Um, the boat will ride way very differently depending on the prop that you select. So bigger props in general will create more lift on the back. So a bigger prop will generally run a bit more wet. So running wet will mean that the front is down. Um, <coughs> and, um, and also the prop geometry is also very dependent on how the, 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 the boat will run. So if you change props like going from Arctura to ABC or, or whatever you might do, um, will definitely change how you need to set everything up for it to run in the best way possible. So that's also a, a, a big misconception and something I didn't realize until, uh, at least not in the beginning of, of doing this. So. Um, yeah, and like I said in general, the bigger the prop, the more lift on the back and when you say it, prop have is a, is, a, is a high lift or whatever prop the lift you're referring to is the is the lift created by the prop so that means the transom coming out the water um, 
which is also something that might be a bit confusing to people. So more lift uh, from the prop will mean a less lift in the front. Uh, so ass up, front down, more or less, is, uh, is how it works. Uh, yeah, that's about it guys. Now get out and make some fast passes.